Yo, what is up, everybody? I am Himo Chico, and we made the cut. So today, we are actually playing with full house money. The cut being made means that we remove the demotional marker. And uh, today, we just get to enjoy. There's a little bit of an asterisk that if we can... Two, 10 today, 10 tomorrow, we might uh, remove another demotional, but that's that's not the issue here uh, uh, in round three and round four. This is just purely for the enjoyment, purely for the golf shots. For me, myself, to get to play actually on the leaderboard on a major is a huge thing. And we have fought hard to be here. So today we're not going to set any lines. We're going to not set any goals outside of being present day and enjoying every single moment of today. Uh, because there is a little bit of a situation approving here on conditions. We are, of course, on the same tee box as whole week. Tees are being set three. And this, this is where it's kind of uh, windy. I've seen a few of the boys play, so we are actually playing into the high side of the very high. So in, in cases, the wind is actually at max. So today, Hurricane Golf returns. Coming in from the northwest. Very soft fairway though helps a lot. Soft green helps a lot. And green speed is at fast and noon and overcast. So it's like a, it's like a 50-60 situation where the winds are absurd, but the but the track is in a sense a little bit more receptive. But uh, there's nothing to nothing to explain here outside of the normal things. Have good wind reads, have good tempo, and then see how many uh, uh, points we can score. Just enjoy it. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. That is the magical word for today: is smile on our face and enjoyment, enjoyment in our soul. And um, I am enjoying this broadcasting thing a lot at the moment. And of course, we are live on twitch we do all of our rounds live on twitch so that link is down below as the first thing if you want to come come see this live and of course if you want to support the channel otherwise chucking a thumbs up on the video is a really 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 good way to push the video to new heights so everybody who's been missing and interacting with the content lately thank you very very much it's clearly working we are seeing a lot of growth both on twitch and youtube at the moment so thank you very much so that's it that's the homework for, homework for you Chuck a thumbs up on the video, and now we go, and my homework is to play well today, so... Right now, boys, the Tour Championships, round three in a hurricane, Pimo Chico, Robin. Look at that wind! Wow! That is quite a lot of wind. Okay, let's go get our fairway, Frank. Nice little bounce too. Should be far enough from those trees. Lovely that. Lovely, lovely that. We are just far enough from those trees. I'm actually going to put a little front and a little bit left to right shape into it as well. Because I'm just a little bit afraid of that tree to begin with. So, uh, this getting a little bit too far to the left makes it so that I'm a little bit apprehensive of the tree. So I just have to put a little bit of shape into it. So this became a, a much more difficult now with the added difficulty of the tree. But nevertheless, we just, we just have to go for it. There's, there is no other thing to do but to do the thing. So let's do the thing. Got it around the tree, but the slow is gonna kill it. I, I, I would have been really good without that slow. Would have been really, really good without the slow. Semi-problematic here just based on the yardage, but the good part here is that this downhill helps. Now we just got to make sure we get it to the downhill and not too far up. There we go. The downhill worked perfectly for us there. So there, the, the bounce puts us a little bit to a dangerous situation where we have to do a sideways shape. 
which I'm not really great at, but I, I think the shaping was good. We just then had the very misfortunate situation there to hit it slow. So we end up on the right side and, and never had a chance. I think if I hit that with a perfect tempo, we would have gotten there. So much wind. So much wind. This into softness should bounce right always and have no chance of going up. Beautiful. Okay, wind is pretty much straight to the face here. That's gonna play so much. That wind is gonna play so much. Look, it just hit. Look at it. <laughs> Dude. Absolutely absurd. It like goes, goes, goes. Hit the wind wall and just drops down. <laughs> oh, wow. But here we had a game plan that we can never be over there. Because over there, unsavable. Unsavable. Completely unsavable. So now a good control swing. Good control pot. Let's see if we have a chance here. I really thought it's gonna go out right. It started turning back right on the second to last grid. I was guaranteed that we lipped it out on the right. Somehow, I may maybe Sokolich to get it in, so... That right there, uh, I will I will accept wholeheartedly. This should give us enough yards to give us the putt. All I wanted is to hit the green and release. There we go. It's a little bit fast, so we ended up on this downhiller now, but uh, it's it's still not bad, boys. It's not bad. It's 11 feet from the hole on a on a quite difficult hole, so we accept, we accept, we accept. And quite uniform break too, so not a lot of pro problems in the in the grids there. I'm gonna stay high line. I don't want this to miss low. Two huge pots there. Two huge pots there. That this this second one is is much more scorable, but uh, two huge scores anyway. Two pots, two scores. Very very cool. And then into a absolutely absurd situation. Six hundred and thirty three yards into a almost maximum wind. So this is driver driver. <laughs> Driver, driver, wedge. It's like 400 yards. 370 still to the hole from here, dude. Yeah, look. And this tree wood is actually safer glove for me, so I'll take this now. It's almost guaranteed a, a, uh, uh, a shot from here in the middle. I don't really know what gainage I would have gotten by hitting the uh, uh, a driver off there. So I'll put a little bit through because I'd rather be a little bit over than on this red bump. That red bump is pretty devilish. That red bump is a little devilish, so I'll add just a little bit through, just in case. But this is again ridiculous. Little bit fast, but it should come around. Maybe I'll baby Sokolich down the hill too. There we go.
I 1 million percent accept that for a, for a, for a little bit of a mistempo. I will 1 million percent accept that. No way it didn't turn, chat. Is it really that much power still? I was so sure of that. That I think that has to turn, but I maybe just too much power. Maybe just just a touch too much power. I just thought it's turning so much on that portion there, but uh, just none. So probably the problem there uh, is rather the uh, too much power than the wrong aim or the combination of the two. Semi heartbreaking to miss that, but I, I, I stand by my aim there. Uh, I don't really understand why did it turn. So I, I'll put my I'll put my brain in a way where we have to say that that was just traveling too far. Or too fast, so it didn't have the time to turn. Okay, here, this is very dangerous if we end up left side. This is not great on the right side either. So now this, this is a very, very, very important day to hit nice. Very important day. And that's the epitome of nice. That is as nice as I can hit a golf shot. So 151. It's going to work against the wind. So the wind is actually not going to play almost none forward. So I think this is going to be A-OK -okay like this. I'll take a little bit off just in case. Because this, this seemed seemingly turned to like a max wind in the end here. And just stay right there and I will fist pump for the rest of my life. Yes! These soft greens are nice when the ball sticks. Okay, so not a lot of breakage. Scoring the fifth, ridiculous. <laughs> Scoring the fifth, ridiculous. Let's go. And then into one of the more difficult situations here. Now here you just need the tempo on the drive. This is just one of those where you just have to hit it. It's usually going to stay up here. It's not going to roll anywhere, but this anywhere from the uh, any anywhere from the fairways was just so so difficult. Here again, uh, we can't go up, so we we have to play it in a way where we can never go up. So here we just have to know that whatever happens, we don't get more than like 172. And uh, this is never going to get even close to that, so we can hit this. I'm going to play it in a little bit of a way where I think it's going to be more on this side. But I can never be here, so this is going to be a little bit less, a uh, little bit less aggressive, a little bit more uh, uh, defensive. I, 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 I would have been so nice. Would have been exactly the 161 without the without the fast. So there the fast makes it problematic. Now though, same thing here. We can hit it fully here because from here in 155 it's gonna roll back. We can we can't also hit it here. So now again, wow. The level of difficulty in these conditions and in this track is just wow. And then baby Sucklich back. 
I accept I didn't want it to go that high up because now now it's like do you now then thunder this or do you now defend this for a bogey? Like which one do you do now? Because if you now thunder it and miss it, it's off the green into the sand. So we, ha even though I, I hate it, we have to defend it. So this became like the toughest six-footer you'll ever see. Scramble city over here. <laughs> Scramble city over here. The, if we're being completely honest, boys, that was probably still in the sand if that doesn't hit the hole. That was probably still traveling too fast. And then here with the softness, we have opportunities, we have systems. We have opportunities and we have systems, but we'd rather be left side, uh, left side light than on the right side uh, bunky. So now again, good golf shot, let's get. The shape is gonna keep it, it's gonna hit this flat, it's gonna bounce left, but how much? There's the soft. Stay on the light, and from the light we play. A lot of the times from the light we play. So here, the, the story of the life is we can't be here. This, this doesn't, this is not going to even get there, right? So now we are just aiming to hit it either here on this bunker or this bunker, or it's going to come down here. But grandedly, uh, uh, grandedly now from this light side, it's not the easiest. But nevertheless, look at how absurd they miss, but still on tempo, let's go. There's the tempo. There is exactly where we aimed we want to land it. Go a little bit up and stay right there. Look, it's, it's a weird hole. No matter what happens, you're taking this same shot. Whatever happens, you're always taking this same shot. Because now we, again, like the, the horror story is we have to hit it enough. Because if we hit it here at 20 yards, it ain't going to go nowhere, right? So this right here now became an excruciatingly difficult situation. Because the only way we can get the ball into the green is now hitting it up, right? And then from there we have to come down. But as you guys see, again, uh, same thing here. Now we have to like mega defend because this is absurd. It's red on the first line behind the hole. It's already red. So difficult here, absolutely absurd. So now, as I said, like we have to play this in a way where it might not even get to the hole, but over, we can't hit it. Like if the ball catches the ridge, it's gone. It's, so we cannot go over the hole here. Okay, so there we, we have to admit that both of those fivers, we, we take two fivers on the cards, but they are not really par fives. The, neither of these are really par fives. They are more like par sixes, right? 657 yards into the wind, uh, uh, there's just no way. Okay, then let's send it. This might be either the best or the worst golf shot I've ever hit. Let's see which one. And then big bounce right and back to the fairway. Ah, yeah, yeah, too far right. Might be in the sand, though. Back to the fairway. There we go. Very, very, very nice. Spin! 
There we go. It's a little bit too far, but that's that's very, very good. <laughs> so I think we have fought out four through eight with two fibers on the card as well, which is kind of naughty. Come on, stay in the fringe. Stay in the fringe. Yes! This is such a horrifying, uh, horrifying hole that getting this into a proximity chipper is really, really awesome. Proximity chipper here, really, really awesome. Let's see what referee has to say about this. Would he uh, be interested in giving this to us? I, 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 very, very, very close. I will gladly tap it in, though. I will gladly tap it in for a, uh, a four, four out. Bogey free minus four out there. I will one million percent accept. And then another fairway get. Beautiful. It's going to come around just enough. Little bit too far left, but it should in the softness die in the middle here without being too much in trouble of the left. Little bit bouncy, but as I said, the wind kills. It should give us a good lie too. Probably a very flatty lie. Maybe a little left to right. And then, of course, again, uh, very much on the unapproachable side. Very much on the unapproachable side, but here we can play a little bit more to the right. We don't have to be that worried about the uh, right side here. Got my tempo too, so it's going to be exactly what I wanted. A little bit on the right side of the hole. Hopefully it doesn't come back. Ay, ay, ay. Did we actually got it to come back? I accept. That qualifies 100%. Okay, so all three beads baked on that. Not a lot or really uh, anything to do with anything. Okay, so this is just impossible. So I'll just play high side, low power again here. Hope for the best. Okay, let me do the power one more time. I'm a little apprehensive of the... Uh, I'm a little apprehensive of the bottom there. This would be a nice, nice uh, curler to curl in though. Gonna, it's gonna turn quite heavily on those first two ones, but then how much it's gonna turn on that like like almost like the two last ones go back right So very very difficult to know will it straighten out or not? I feel like it won't so let's go Very very difficult Oh, it did straighten out look there you go Oh, that was a very good read. Very good read on a very, very, very disgusting grid there. Good read, good read, good read. Very acceptable read. And again, absolutely ridiculous ask of the player to hit this golf shot. But what can I say? What can I say? Let's try our best. I hit it too, so maybe, just maybe, it's in the pocket. Maybe, just maybe, it doesn't roll up. Oh my days. That was a mega shaped tree, tree iron around the tree with a perfect tempo. <laughs> that is absurd. Come on, let's score 11th. Scoring 11th would be some sort of a fien phenom. Same thing here, by the way. Uh, we cannot lose the ball, so power off first. Aye, aye, aye. So, like, the idea, the idea that we are low is, is okay, but I couldn't put a third one. I couldn't put a third one. That's just one of those where... Again, the, the, the thing is the same as always now in Platt. Every single hole, after the hole, it's ready into the ditch. So you are really, like, not allowed to putt anything in this track. 
I am not allowed because I play defensive, right? I choose to play defensive. So here we go a little bit around the tree. I've been a little bit scared to eat that tree. So here we will just go around the tree. This should always pop right as well from the middle. Oh, that's, that's really nice. Got my tempo. Stay on the stay on the green. Stay on the green. Stay on the green. So a little bit too much. Little bit too much or too little aim there. So we, we actually came out. Uh good news, bad news though, probably better than the, the pot from that yellow. Good news, bad news, probably better than the yellow. Oh, wow. Mega rolled. That is actually very surprising that it rolled that much. Is it really that much downhill? How did that roll that much? Holy... I don't understand that at all, by the way. Like... It just like teleported down on a on a soft uh, soft situation. Just teleports down, man. Absolutely ridiculous. Don't know why. Maybe it just got a little bit too far, so it actually hit the the flat and the down instead of the baby uphill there. Look at that wind, dude. <laughs> Look at that wind. That is just in a word absolutely absurd. Spin is on, so maybe it's it's not in the sand. We play from this sand uh, uh, gladly. We play from this sand gladly into this wind. We play gladly from the beach. Get off that part train, buddy. Get off the train. Love, love, love that. Oh, wow. Look at that wind. What? This is probably those that it's going to play forward. I just can't stay out of the fast in this one, chat. I just could never stay out of the fat and it's gonna block too. Oh wow, get so lucky, dude. Get so lucky there. Horror, horror splash though now. Really, really tough because it's such a short swing now. Really, really difficult to take this short of a swing. That's a save and a half. This is probably one. Of, I, I think I've hit three out of three fast here. This this has my number. This this uh, definitely has my number. This uh, this hole. Okay, and then the best opportunity for something beautiful in the in the back here. Now though, tempo rules. There we go. Wind played a little bit less than we uh, we dreamed about, but this same thing here again. We have been here before. Sometimes it even gets here, but most of the time it's gonna pop here and go down. Yeah, a little bit off, a little bit off there uh, uh, on the on the aim. Uh, the wind played a little bit less than I, I had counted there, and we it pops exactly where we want. It should go that way too. So there we go. This is very much where how we played this. Uh, we could not ever reach to the hole, so every eagle opportunity we had was a chip. So this should be a very, very, very decent 68 pitcher here. I'm I'm going to have to leave it. Uh, I'm going to have to give it enough so that the wind has time to play. So into this wind into this much shape, still a very, very problematic shot. Because you have to give that uh, wind quite a lot to play. So, 
very much now a wind read, the pitch read that we haven't done many a time in our career. But nevertheless, we have to trust our knowledge and go. It's not like we can we can we can give up here. Okay, so here we here we are gonna ride the lighting a little bit with the wind. This is this is a difficult shot. I'd rather be on this side than go over. But I have to shape it because of that tree right there will play if I don't shape it. The tree will play. So this right here is exactly where I wanted the ball. This much rather than over. This much rather than over. Okay, what if we what if we splash an eagle for the culture here once? I'm gonna add a little bit more power than I normally would. Just for the just for the culture boys. I'm gonna add a little bit more yards than I normally would, yeah? Too too bad I hit it fast. Too bad I hit it fast, it turned on the left side. Beautiful. Needed the tempo here. Now softly to the right. Softly to the right. I got it to the wrong place, so we were like four yards short there, so it actually popped left. But this back this back location here is a quite the proximity hunt anyway. So we have to put a little loft ski into this. 217, take 20 out of that would be 197 if it goes a little bit up. Okay, okay, okay. Show me something great. I, I'll definitely will. I'll definitely try. Uh, I can't put any shape into this because the uphill lie is already playing. I can't really attack it either, so more than likely we're going to end up either here or here because we are not allowed to end up here. Lie is very nice for us, though, so lie we don't have to worry about. I can't believe it popped out. Now I have to hit like a mega roller. Luckily, it does come from the light. Luckily, it does come from the light. But I think this is gone. I do think this is probably Gunnions. I'm gonna try to hit the sideways Derbler, but I think this is Gunnions. So unfortunate pass there. And we got it into the one place that it was supposed to never ever be, which was this sliver of rough here. Oh my god, the sideways kept it! Did it! The sideways kept it! <laughs> the sideways derbler kept it! Are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? <laughs> Yo, the sideways actually kept it. All I'm thinking there is if if we can somehow use the left to right, if we can somehow use the left to right, it might keep it. Oh my days, now we deserve to save this. Now we 1 million percent deserve to save this. Okay, one more, boys. One more. Let's go get at it. Let's go absolutely go get at it. Here we get to enjoy the wind. I'm going to put a little bit left to right shape just in case we hit it a little bit fast because this right side rough still works for us. Of course, I'm going to go for the straight ball, but I never want it to be too far left. 
One more fairway frank here, and then let's go hunt for a minus seven. Now land soft. Land soft. Soft. Stop. Okay. I'll take that. I will one million percent take that. Here we have to play it up here because anything from the low side, it comes all the way to the bunker. Anything low side becomes all the way to the bunker. So we just have to, uh, we just have to have like courage here. We just have to have courage here. Courageous shot. Even if it stops on this bunker, okay. But I just don't want it here for the mega splash back. Now I just, as I said, I, I have to be courageous here to push up now. It's a horror lie, horror wind, horror everything, but I just have to be courageous now. Now let's put on our big boy pants. Our size extra small pants. Our size six sailing shoes. And let's go get at it. Two but this for a bogey free round three would be quite the vivacious experience. Two but this for a bogey free minus six, I would take it to the bank every day of the week. With the horror story that we have three fivers on the card. So this is going to this is going to roll like an absolute animal, so I'm gonna have to take all the power off and keep it high side. This is gonna roll like absolutely like an animal, so we just have to be careful here. Keep it very, very high side, low power. This looks absolutely ridiculous where I'm aiming, I know. Come on. One more for the culture here. A little bit too careful. Never, uh, never had a chance and didn't even guarantee the, the par. So, in a, in a sense, disgustingly, uh, disgustingly uh, short putt. Uh, to still be six feet from the hole, but uh, I just I just thought it's gonna go much further. Okay, let's not let's not stuff off the bogey free here. Yeah. In a sense, like uh, a tale of two stories. We play really really well, but then we have three fivers in the car, right? We uh. We, we play really, really well, but glorying mistakes, we can't get close enough on those fivers. And then a few pretty bad uh, uh, wind misreads there. But in general, I am going to say that that's a good round. That is a very, very, very good round. I will, I will say this, though. I am not happy with those fives. But as a, in general, that round, I'm not going to use it a fantastic but I will say that minus six bogey free here, specifically with those three fivers on the card, that qualifies. All righty then. It's, uh, it's, uh, it's as battle golf as battle golf can be. It's, it's as battling as uh, the, the battle golf there is absolutely crazy. Like we fight, we claw our way up there. We do everything we can for a minus six, which we have to be happy about. We are left with one more round to play, which is uh, then tomorrow, round four. So all is left to do is ask of you guys to please chuck a thumbs up on this video. And uh, thank you so much to everybody that's been messing with the content lately. The, the YouTube and the Twitch both are growing very, very rapidly. So thank you everybody who's been messing with the content and chucking those thumbs ups and chucking those comments and even sharing the video to your friend. Share the video to your friend. Say, hey, my boy Hima Chico would like a new subscriber on YouTube. He's short and ugly and poor. And all he wants is you to click on this link and press the subscribe button completely free to make his day. Easy. Let's get involved. Let's all get involved and grow the culture together. So that's your homework. Follow the Twitches. Leave a comment and a like and share this video with somebody <laughs> who has not watched virtual golf on the internet before. Okay, that's the spiel for today. One last time.
Thank you so much for watching. And we will re reconvene here tomorrow for round four, where we finish the job and see how far up the leaderboard can we actually push. But for now, Mokkyo is out. Peace!